Hi class, so I am going to be trying to use this uh, new program to bring you a series of videos in today's PowerPoint. So if the PowerPoint does not just play uh, on its own, just be sure to go to each slide and play the movie. Every slide is a movie, either a movie of me explaining slides or an actual movie movie. So Zeus is going to be helping me here with our um, lesson today. He went out on assignment with me to bring you some science. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. So we're going to be studying bridges, which I'm really excited about. Bridges are a thing of both beauty, function, and physics. Uh, and so I think this one here, hopefully when you look at that picture, you not only uh, are amazed, but uh, lots of good questions start popping into your head about the bridge itself and why it looks the way it does and how it works, like what makes bridges uh, be as stable as they are. Um, if you wonder why we're studying bridges, so if you think back in September when we um, built our catapults. If you look in your book, Unit 1, the actual theme of that chapter was bridges. And as a school district, we decided to focus on catapults. And so we skipped a lot of the information that had to do with bridges. So I'm really excited to go back and study them now as a way to review some of our physics on forces and to also um, be able to learn some new physics. So here's a picture of a very, very old bridges. Of course, bridges have been around for a very long time. This one is over 800 years old and it's still standing as it was built, like it has not been renovated. And we have uh, old bridges all across, and we have many new and amazing modern bridges also. Uh, some of the basic structure is the same, and then of course there's been many new materials and technologies that have helped us improve on the basic bridges of old. Uh, here's a picture of the Golden Gate Bridge in California. It uh, crosses the bay at San Francisco. Beautiful, beautiful bridge. And I have to tell you that this is these type of things are why I went into science. It wasn't really the math formulas and things like that, although uh, I enjoy those. I would look at a picture like this and just be amazed and awed at the beauty. And then my mind would start asking questions, everything from about the bridge and why it works and why it doesn't wobble and to the clouds why are they not touching the water but they're almost touching the water to the color of the sky all of it uh, left me with questions and then I get excited about math that helps me answer those questions uh, so that's what brought me to science is really beauty so bridges for me are a very fun thing to be studying they're both very scientific functional and beautiful uh, so here's a bridge in Greece, very different looking, but once again, uh, those, those tall spikes you see are not just for decoration, although we will be watching someone talking about how there's bridges are both functional and beautiful, and that's how they think it should be. Uh, so next is going to be a, on a new slide, a video of me and Zeus. So throughout this video, uh, throughout this PowerPoint, I have some live videos that I shot by me and Zeus for on different bridges around the Everett area. So like I said in this PowerPoint, that when this video is over, go to the next slide if it does not autoplay and just play the next video. Each slide will be a video for you to listen to. So I hope you like this, have fun, uh, and let's see what we talked about when me and bridge were on, me and Zeus were on the bridge.